Hi everyone, this is Catalina from TheDreamIntoReality.com and today we are going to be opening the Cricut Explorer 3. I have it right here along with the vinyl roll holder and also in the box in case you decide to get a bundle. I always recommend to get a bundle when you buy a machine because you get so much more than you know if you were to buy all the things separately. So let's get closer to the machine and see if it's worth it or not. This is the box that the Cricut Explorer 3 comes in and I am very excited to see it. I haven't opened it yet because I wanted to wait for you guys to see everything that is inside the box. It, the Cricut Maker 3 has a handle. I wonder if it's because it's heavy or not, but this one doesn't have one. So let's just open it. Okay, oh my gosh, so excited. It says here, you were born creative. And here it says, because I speak Spanish. Somos creativos por naturaleza. Which, it doesn't translate the same thing, but it's still a beautiful message. Now here's our machine, and then when we open it, we have like a welcome envelope shall we open it of course we should oh the sticker is taking a while and it's kind of like a let's get started paper where you can find more information about the setup and tutorials and things like that but honestly just go to my blog or the links because sometimes it can be a little bit confusing to, to get started. But don't worry, today we're gonna connect the machine and we're gonna do a test cut. We also have a scrap of smart vinyl, which something really cool about this new machine when you compare it to Explore Air 2 or any of the Explore Air families or any of the other older Explore machines is that you can cut without a mat when using Smart Vinyl. I've already seen videos of people cutting this type of materials though with the other machines, so I'm sure that there, is, there could be a way. We're gonna do a test cut using this piece of vinyl for sure. And we also have the sample of materials. Let's open them. We have some smart vinyl, a little bit of transfer tape. Oh, smart iron on. This is for you to make t shirts and things like that. And this is sticker cardstock, which I think is really cool. Let's set this aside. And here we have the machine. Now, with all their machines, you used to get a mat and also a Cricut pen. And Cricut would include a first project and it was a card. I really like that. And I am quite disappointed that is not included anymore and that you don't have a mat and you don't have a pen. You really need a mat. I know the purpose of these new machines was to promote smart vinyl and matless cutting, but you cannot just get rid of the mat because you have to cut paper, scraps of vinyl uh, for print and cut projects if you want to make a cake top or anything. Everything really requires a man. So if you buy this machine and you are no new to Cricut and then you decide to make a card, you can't. And it's just annoying because there is a lot of people that don't live in the United States and don't have access to Amazon or mats or stuff like that, like we do. I have family back in Colombia that can't 
that if they buy the machine, they would be like, okay, what do I do now? So Cricut, please, if you ever see this video, start including a mat with these new machines. The same happened with the Cricut Maker 3 and you can see my review as well. So let's get this machine out. This one is tricky to get off. Oh my gosh, this is hard to get out. Ugh. I drop it. What's this? Here it is. And we also have the USB cable if you like connecting your machine via USB to your computer. I don't like them, I always use Bluetooth, but this is a free world, right? Ready to open the Explore 3. Comes in this nice little protective color. Now the Explore, the other Explore family machines are very shiny. This one is more of a matte color. So it's for sure something new. Here it is. Oh, by the way, while I oh, take this paper off, make sure you give a like to this video. It helps with the YouTube algorithm, so. Please, please, please. Okay, now we have this off. Now, it is quite beautiful. I don't know, so this part is, is shiny and this one is matte. I don't know what to think, honestly. I think it's beautiful, but I prefer shiny. I feel it's easier to clean and all of that. So let's take away this little sticker. There is not slot for cartridges anymore. If you're new to Cricut, this won't really matter to you, but if you are old in the game and you have a bunch of cartridges, you will need an adapter that honestly is never available. So you can find a friend that may have a, an older machine with a, with a slot for you to transfer all your designs and link them to the design space. Okay, let's open it. This is the opening button, which it also changed a little bit. And that's very pretty. And then here's the power button. This is for your to load your materials or the Cricut mat that is not included again. Start button and also a pause button. There is also a little foam here to protect. This is kind of like the computer of the machine, so it's a big deal. And this is the clamp A where you installed your tools. And then here you have the clamp B where you installed your blade. And it comes installed already. It's really gorgeous. I love Cricut tools, don't get me wrong. I really do, that's why I do this channel. And here we have more space for you to put other little tools in here and for you to put blades. It also includes this little dock station in case you like using your iPad or a phone. I don't really use it that much, but hey, to each its own. I already opened it. If you wanna see the unboxing, make sure to check out my Maker 3 unboxing video and it is really cool. I really, it feels heavy and it's high quality like everything Cricut. I really love how it feels on my hands. I do feel it's a lot, 
of money for just something that will hold vinyl in place. I don't think you need to buy it, but if you do, I mean, I think the machine looks really cute with it. So it has this little holes over here. And then you will just flip it like this. And then they have like these little guides here and then this kind of like guides here too. You slide it in and it keeps everything in place. Let's take it off and how about we open the box in case you order the bundle. I like that. Seriously guys, I love getting bundles. For me, it's like the best value ever. This is the box you would get if you order a bundle from Cricut.com. It comes with the essential tool set. This trimmer is a little bit different because it has 13 inches in width and that's very useful in case you decide to use a lot of the smart materials. Smart materials mean that you can cut them without a mat. And it comes with the scoring stylus. There is a um, weeding tool. A, these are some tweezers, spatula, scraper, scissors, and, and these are like replacement blades. And it actually has like a little scoring tool. It's quite cool. And it also comes with a basic tool set with again, weed or spatula, tweezers, scraper, and scissors. Now, I don't know about you, but I don't need two of these. I rather have them include a mat, which can you believe that you buy a bundle and you don't get a mat? I really don't understand. I just really don't. And it's a little bit disappointing as I was telling you before, but if you don't have mats, make sure that you get them because you won't be able to do anything else. Like you can't cut Cricut Infusible ink or regular paper. You would be like just doing vinyl projects that we only have so many teachers to make, right? Most of the things are done in, on the mat. We also have this multi-pen set and you know, there's like different tip sizes, like the extra fine, this is the gel pen, and then markers and the calligraphy marker, and these are really cool. We also have Smart Vinyl. Again, you can cut this one without a mat, but when you have small pieces, again, you need a mat. And here, let's see here. Now, when I filmed the maker video, I opened this one, but I have other ones that I'm gonna open a, for the Explore 3. And then every time you see a transparent box, that's vinyl. And if you see a matte box or, you know, it's not a see-through box, then this is iron on. And this is transfer tape. Transfer tape works with smart vinyl and it's for you to, you know, you cut a little bit and that helps you transfer it to, to the surface. Let's move this aside so we can keep opening the box. So exciting. It's like Christmas. Here's some glitter iron on. And I am very excited to try sticker card suck because I just love paper projects. Paper projects are my favorite projects. Let me open this. You see, I loved a couple of things to open on this video. It's taking a while. Oh my gosh, I just love this yellow so much. My favorite color is yellow. And there's a couple of, you know, there's different colors. The ones that you see here on the box, they're really beautiful. 
and I'm excited to to use it. No? Gotta make a couple of projects with this. What would you like to make? Let me know in the comments. I didn't open this one either. And you see, sometimes I also use weeders to open my stuff. Maybe this is wrong, but I like it. Let's see what colors we're gonna find here. This is Smart Vinyl again. We have more white, more red, and more black. Okay, nothing new here. Hopefully this one will be different. I guess they're popular colors, right? I think colors may vary depending on your machine, but I wish they were different. Oh, now we have other colors. I like this better. Our smart vinyl. And we have it here on have like this cute little orange. And we have it here in green. And this is all the vinyl we got. I mean, two black ones, two. Oh, but they're different. No, oh, they're the same. We have white. Oh, it just. Okay, I see. There is like white, red, and black permanent vinyl, and this is removable vinyl in the same colors. So that's neat. And we also have only three different colors of the Smart Iron On, which, what can we do? And again, tons of transfer tape. So that's really nice. I think there's a lot of goodies in here and I just love opening every single little box and just get the bundle, trust me. Now, how about we connect the machine and we make the first cut. We are gonna do the test cut using the little piece of adhesive vinyl they included in their welcome envelope. And I'm gonna connect the machine to my computer and we're also gonna pair it to Cricut Design Space. So let's just go to my laptop. I have a Windows system, uh, but I do have an article that I'm gonna leave in the description in case you decide to, in case you have another device, this is just what I have. So I'm gonna click on add Bluetooth or other device and click on add a device on Bluetooth here. And let's wait for Cricut to find it. It's right here, so click on it and let's connect it. If you are asked for a password, just type in 000040s and that should do it. So my Cricut Explore 3 is already paired, so I'm gonna go to Design Space. So I'm here on the home interface and I'm gonna click on this little toggle menu and I'm gonna click here on new product setup and click on smart cutting machine and I'm gonna connect the Explore 3. It gives us like, you know, you have to keep your machine at this distance from the wall and then to power your machine and to connect it via USB cable or through Bluetooth, but we already connected it. So click on continue. Cricut just found an update for my machine and I before you can use it, you have to update it. And this may take a while, you know, it may take like five minutes or so. While your machine updates, why don't you go to Instagram and follow me? My username is Daydream Into Reality. Expert 3 is up today, so let's click on next. And this is gonna tell me to register my machine and I am doing it too. You know, this is my email and you have to agree to Cricut's terms and conditions. Now let's click on next. And this is a little test cut. Uh, I think uh, for the Maker 3, I did this cute little crown, but I think that now I wanna do the mountains. I love mountains, you guys. 
What do you prefer, the mountains or the beach? I love the mountains more than the beach. Now, let's go to the machine. Okay, I'm going to uh, load the material now. It takes a while. And now I'm gonna press the flash and go button. And let's wait for it to cut. That's fast, isn't it? Wow. <laughs> okay, now I'm going to unload it. It's such a fast thing, you guys. Now, for it to be this fast, you have to be using smart materials. If you got a bundle, you have one of these little tools. And if not, make sure that you get some weeding tools because they're really useful to remove negative cuts from your projects. So I'm just going to remove it real quick. To transfer vinyl, you need transfer tape, but I am not feeling like getting transfer tape right now. So you can just pick it up too. I mean, if this was like a super serious project, I would be using transfer tape, but I am not. And now you're gonna hear my little boy on the outside, outside of my office. <laughs> this is motherhood, you guys, I'm not gonna hide. First, I'm a mom. Okay, just a minute. I'm gonna put it here in this little folder. And that's it. It's cute. I think I've said more than enough. How about we wrap up this video? Okay, guys, so, you saw what comes inside the machine, you saw the vinyl roll holder, also all the goodies that come with the machine. If you decide to get a bundle, I really think it's a good value. So that's all the good. I love all the materials. I love that you can cut without a mat. I love that now, and I forgot to mention this, but you can print and cut uh, on colored in patterned paper and I mean if it's very light pattern you couldn't do that with the other explore machines and now you can do it I like all the upgrades my main complaint is that it doesn't come with a Cricut mat and let me get it for you a Cricut mat is very important for you to cut paper cardstock to make a card to do everything else and also you can use it with vinyl but they decided to not include this on your bundle or inside the machine. And quite frankly, I think that is terrible. I'm not gonna lie to you. I don't like it. I don't like that it doesn't come with it. And I am going to voice my opinion. But other than that, honestly, go for it. I love it. I love the, the machine. I think you're going to have so much fun. No company is ever perfect, right? <laughs> but I really do like Cricut. I do. And I have tons of tutorials. Make sure to check the links in the description if you want to see them. And also, there's more videos coming soon. And... <laughs> That's it. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.